Okay, question number six from October 2018 International A level. Vector's question actually starts over here. It says um, in this question, the unit vectors i and j are horizontal vectors um, due east and due north, respectively, and position vectors are given relative to a fixed origin. The point A on a horizontal playground has position vector 3i minus 2j. At time t equals zero, a girl kicks a ball from A. The ball moves horizontally along the playground with constant velocity 4i plus 5j. Modeling the ball, ball as a particle, find the speed of the ball. Well, that's the speed of the ball is basically the magnitude of its velocity. The magnitude of the velocity, which is going to be given by 4 squared plus 5 squared, because it's going 4i plus 5j. So it's going to be, this is the velocity. So that's 4, that's 5. So you're using Pythagoras' theorem, basically. So it's going to be the square root of 16 plus 25, which is 41. So you're going to have the square root of 4 squared plus 5 squared, which is the square root of 41. Okay, um, but I didn't tell you how to give the answer. You can leave it like this if you want, or you can write it to 3SF if you wish. Okay, 6.40. 6.40 meters Per second both of these are perfectly fine because they didn't mention how to write it in terms of in 3sf whatever then part b so that's part a then part b says the position vector of the ball at time t seconds now the position vector of something is given by the position when time is zero plus its velocity times the general um you know the term for t the time okay so in this case, the position vector at time equals zero. Okay, at time equals zero, girl kicks the ball from A, and the position vector of A is 3i minus 2j. So it's 3i minus 2j. And the velocity of the, the ball is 4i plus 5j. So therefore, the position vector of the ball is its position vector at zero plus the velocity times the time. So it's t times 4, 5. It's best to give it in the same format that they ask for it. So you can write it as um, 3i minus 2j plus t times 4i plus 5j. Okay? So that's how you're going to write your answer. You should always try to keep that area blank. Okay. Now, um, those are perfectly fine. That's probably better to write in this way because that's the way they gave you the questions. Okay, the position vector of the ball at time t seconds. Okay, now that's part B. Then it says the point B on the play playground has position vector i plus 6j. At time t equals capital T seconds, the ball is due east of B. Okay, so it's due east of b when time is t seconds so there's a couple of ways we can um sort out this problem okay if it's due east of something okay then basically um if this is point b if it's due east that's north that's east so the the ball is going to be over here somewhere okay so the ball's going to be over here, and due east means it's going to be in this direction. So basically, what you can notice is, okay, that the position vector of uh, this, it's i plus 6j, and the position vector of this is given by 3 minus 2 plus t, 4, 5. Okay, if it's due east, then the the j components, okay, the j components will be equal to each other. The j components will be the same, the due east. Okay, they'll have the same j components. Okay, so you can say that 3 minus 2 plus t times 4, 5, okay, is your position vector. And the position vector of, of b is... 1 and 6, 
Okay, now if one is due east of the other, they'll have the same j component. So you can say minus 2 plus 5t has to be the same value as 6. These two have to be the same. Okay, so you can say 5t is equal to 8. So t is equal to 8 over 5. Okay, and 8 over 5 gives you 1.6. Okay, this is 6, 1.6 seconds. Okay, 8 divided by 5. Okay, so that's because they're, if they're in the same horizontal level, the J components must be the same. So this J component must be the same as this J component. This is for where the point B and this is for where the ball is at, point, at time T. Okay, so that's 1.6 seconds, that's part C. And then part D says, um, a boy is running due east with speed V meters per second. At the instant when the girl kicks the ball from A, the boy is at B. Given that the boy intercepts the ball, find the value of B. Okay, so the boy is running due east. So for the boy, okay, it's called the boy. He's running due east. So his speed is V meters per second. So due east means one, zero. It's some, some constant times one, zero. We don't know uh, exactly. Um, we don't know exactly. Um, it's we just know the direction and we know the speed is v okay so it's going to be v times one zero is going to be his velocity okay we know that's the direction and that's the magnitude okay at the instant when the girl kicks the ball so that that's that's the speed okay um the boy is at b now what's the position vector of b the position vector of b is one six Okay, so let's just let's just work this out properly. So you have the position vector of the boy at zero is going to be, as we just saw here, it's going to be one six. Okay, that's one six. That's where he is in the beginning. He's going at velocity. The velocity vector is equal to we don't know what exactly what it is, so it's V times one zero, so you can say V zero. Okay, you're running at constant speed V. Okay, so it's V zero, you can say. Okay, so we can say that R of the boy is equal to one six plus time times V zero. Okay, it's going due east. Okay, now at the instant when the girl kicks the ball from A, the boy is at B. Okay. Given that the boy intercepts the ball, find the value of B. So that, that means the position vector of the boy and the position vector of the ball have to be the same. Okay, and the position vector of the ball is given by this vector here. Okay, which was 3 over 2, 3, three minus 2 and 4, 5. So for the ball, you have 3 minus 2 time plus t times 4, 5. And we know that these must be equal to each other, okay, um, because they get to the same place at the same time, all right? The boy intercepts the ball. Okay, so you've got 1, 6, plus t times v, 0, equals 3 minus 2, plus t times 4, 5. Okay, so you have 1 plus Vt is equal to 3 plus 4t. And you have 6 is equal to minus 2 plus 5t. So we're going to have t equals 1.6 seconds as we got. That's 8 over 5. Okay. And therefore V, you got 1 plus V times 1.6 equals 3 plus 4 times. 1.6. Okay, so we can work out what V is. So you're going to have 
1.6 v 1.6 v is equal to uh, let's do 3 3 plus 4 times 1.6 okay and you're going to do minus 1 that gives you 8.4 so v is going to be 8.4 over 1.6 which gives you 5.25 and V is the speed okay so it's 5.25 meters per second so V is 5.25 and there's the answer to that question okay because we know that they, he intercepts the ball and because it's due east 1.6 seconds which we found from here anyway and then 1.6 seconds is the value of t so that's you can put that instead of the t there and you find what v is okay